Hello everyone. Hi. I'm Emre. I'm Mohamed. We are junior students at Özgün University as electrical and electronics engineers. Today we want to show our term project, Let Comfort. It's a project for our uh, microprocessors course. Let Comfort is a Arduino based simulation of uh, the popular mind game Connect4. In that game, you uh, drop the you drop Disc. discs and uh, try to make four in a row. Uh, you can make that four in a row in diagonally, vertically, and horizontally. Now, my friend Mohammed uh, will talk about the details of this device. Yes, here uh, you can see our project. There is a screen made by. LEDs, uh, actually LED matrix. Uh, these matrix consist of these LED arrays, and these LED arrays consist of eight uh, LEDs. But we disassembled one of the LEDs uh, and we shorted here. Uh, these uh, LED matrix uses I2C communication to address itself. Uh, as the first uh, LEDs is addressed itself as the first and the second is second and uh, this is 29th. Uh, we did this to have the exact uh, version of the Connect4 game. Uh, we we are it looked like we have seven column and seven rows but it's not like that the sixth row here is to play the game and the one row here uh, uh, is to select where you are dropping your disk here also we have a uh, buttons uh, the right button is to move the light to the right and the left button to move to the left uh, the middle button is to drop uh, the light to selected column. It's like this. Uh, when after you dropped uh, your disc, the game turns to the next player, and the second player drops its disc, and it goes like this. Like this then whenever you do four in a row in a vertical or uh, horizontal or uh, diagonal manner uh, the game is over one, one of the player wins who wins is decided by uh, the color of the leds here the blue will win the game uh, like this it blinks to show that blue won now my friend Emre will tell you about more of uh, this our project. Uh, as Mohammed said, uh, the most challenging part was disassembling these parts. So uh, we made a short circuits of the we made a short circuit uh, after disassembling the LEDs by the first pin of that LED to fourth pin. That uh, the Arduino doesn't understand that there is an LED, so there's not an address for it. So we can. They literally skip it so that the which makes us uh, which makes the uh, one neo pixel array with eight LEDs becomes a seven LEDs seven uh, LEDs array uh, when we are looking at the similar projects uh, we actually didn't see any original connect for most of them was made on a 8xA matrices uh, so, but we don't want to do that because we want the real soul of the Connect4 game. Uh, and now I will talk about the parts parts we used. We we used seven NeoPixel, uh, uh, eight LEDs NeoPixel arrays. Like and this. Yeah, and we used three buttons to change the position of the discs, uh, and one Arduino Uno device. And inside there is a small board for for the assembling the buttons, 
and a battery. Demo. And now we want to show you the demo. Yes. Uh, we have a demo mode which uh, drops the discs randomly. Yes, we need to uh, press restart button with the one of these three buttons, then release restart button, then we release these buttons, then uh, the demo mode starts. Here the blue wins. Demo mode shows us how the game operates. Uh, uh, it's a little demonstration for you to understand the game. So let's play a real game with a real opponent. So let's play, let me play first, or you. You go first, bro. Oh, thank you. Now I think I won. Yeah. Pushes, bro. Oh, thank you. Uh, I want to mention uh, a thing. Uh, this type of games can have a solution. Uh, for example, Tic Tac Toe has a solution. If you do right moves, uh, you cannot be, uh, you cannot lose. But uh, sometimes you win. Sometimes you. Uh, draw with your opponent. Uh, this Connect 4 game also has a solution unfortunately. I don't know right now uh, but I hope that I will explore it uh, sometime. Uh, so if you do right moves in this game you never lose but sometimes you win sometimes you draw with your opponent or stalemate. I also want to thank you to our instructor. Let, let's not say I. We we want to thank you also our instructor, associate professor Hasan Fatih Urda, uh, for to give us this opportunity. Yeah, for to giving us this opportunity uh, to this good project. I hope uh, you liked our project. Uh, if you have any comments of this project, we would like to hear your comments. And if you like, also you can like our video. Yeah. Thanks for watching. That's Goodbye. It. Thank you.